I just wanna look good for you, good for you. Uh -huh. Selena Gomez is getting candid about growing up in the entertainment industry and says she felt pressure to be overtly sexual in her music videos. I want a boyfriend. The 28-year-old singer covers the October issue of Allure and reveals how her breakout role on Disney Channel's Wizards of Waverly Place affected her day-to-day -day life. How do you do it? The same thing I always do, entertaining myself when the entertainment is not entertaining me. Quote, my personal life was out everywhere. It felt very claustrophobic and I felt very trapped. Selena says the media dissected everything from her dating life to her weight, something the singer describes as unfair for someone to handle. <laughs> Miss Russo, even though you're frozen, I can see you. <laughs> what about now? After Wizards came to an end in 2012, Selena turned her focus to her music, releasing her debut album Stars Dance in 2013 and Revival in 2015. And now Selena is sharing that she felt a demand to be overly sexual in some of the music videos. Quote, there was pressure to seem more adult on my album Revival. I felt the need to show skin. I really don't think I was that person. Can't keep my hands to myself. Just wanna look good for you, good for you. Uh -uh. And despite the challenges of fame that came with her Disney stardom, Selena says she's grateful for how she got her start. I just feel really blessed to have this opportunity. And she's learned to protect herself by never Googling her name. Quote, I haven't done that in years. I honestly can't. I'm strong in a lot of ways, but I think I just have way too much of a sensitive heart. Now, oftentimes when Selena uses her platform, it's for a cause, like mental health. Back in April, Selena revealed she was diagnosed with bipolar disorder. After years of going through a lot of different things, I realized that I was bipolar. The triple threat explained why her diagnosis was empowering. Quote, once I did find out more about who I was, I was proud. I also felt comfortable knowing that I wasn't alone and I was going to get through it. So I will always be passionate about that. It's something I will continue to talk about. And all that echoes what Selena told ET in 2017. I think that for me, I'm really big on vulnerability. I think people are really scared to, to be honest with themselves and strength is looked upon as, oh, I'm strong, I don't need anything, I, can't ha I can handle everything, and that's just not the truth. I want people to know that every, every single life is valuable and that there are people who are willing to be there for them.